before we go to the actual fixes and different methods let's discuss few common issues it can be insufficient network signal network coverage misconfiguration software conflict or a glitch with the built-in messaging app or maybe you have switched from iPhone to Android it can be a career problem too so since we know that these are the basic problems we can we can perform all those steps written in here um, which is first to check the signal bar check the network coverage and see if the signals are good and you are getting the network you can also replace your sim which is most probably free uh, in many countries um, just your change your sim and see if you're able to get the masters now you can also switch network temporarily from LTE to 2G or 2G to Edge whatever is available just try that and see if you can get the message as a first method open the messaging app and go to settings in the settings go to manage sim card message option it can vary uh, from provider to provider from um, sorry from Android version to Android version and uh, it can be varied based on the device you are using uh, you know different for Samsung for HTC for Sony it can be on different places so you just have to go to uh, manage sim messages and delete all the unimportant messages from there so that it cleans up some space on your sim and then try if you can receive the message now go to your home screen and open your built-in messaging app and go back to menu again and then tap on settings and from there increase the number of text messages that might help you another method is to go to settings and then open the application manager it can be apps on some devices and then locate messaging or messages the name can be different on different devices and so on my mobile it's messages I'm gonna get to storage you just have to clear data and clear cache it can be on the main page or it can be in the advanced settings or the storage tab now once you have cleared the cache and the data try sending an SMS and see if you can get some the other method is if you have recently switched from iOS to Android you might have left the iMessage option on on your iPhone so if you have just switched from iPhone to I from iPhone to Android, you just have to get an iPhone if you have that available. Put your SIM card in that, wait for the network, and then go to your messaging app. Let me demonstrate on an iPhone now. Uh, you go to settings. Once you are in settings, you go to messages. Uh, okay messages and then turn off the iMessage option from here and you have to do the same for the FaceTime once it is done just try sending an SMS now on your Android phone go to Google Play Store and on, click on the menu on the left side go to my apps and games and see if your third-party app requires any kind of update by third-party app we are referring to a messaging app which is used otherwise the built-in messaging app now once you have updated that you should get some you, you should start getting the SMS now if you have a custom OS you have to go to settings apps and then tap on your built-in messaging app and disable the option so that you can get the SMS the other method is to open your messaging app go to the menu and from menu tap on settings and settings you need to locate an option which is called spam settings or it can be harassment filter or sometimes it is hidden in the advanced tab just go there and see if you have spam filter turned on and you have any number or string added in the spam filter clear all that up and then restart your device and see if you are getting any message you can also go for a network registration reset uh, take out your sim card insert it into another phone turn it on and on and then wait once it is on and it has got the signal switch again 
the mobile set and then wait again to get the network and then see um, if it is getting any kind of message we can also go for a radio retest radio re reset um, it can vary from device to device you have to search for your mo phone model and with the clause of with the string of radio reset code normally the iPhone is with hash hash two five three two seven hash and the stock Android is hash hash eight seven three two eight three hash uh, sometimes Sony Samsung or any other manufacturer that change the code you have to search for your phone model and the video reset code just dial that in your dialing pad press dial and that will reset your radio okay so the last method is to perform a factory reset if none of these options help you or your issue is still not fixed so before sending your device for a uh, troubleshooting or, fa or, or uh, you know uh, for the further investigation it's best to go for a factory reset don't forget to take a backup uh, let me show you how we can do a factory reset so uh, assuming that you have taken all kind of backups and your data is secure go to settings from here go to backup and reset options it can be on the first page or maybe it is hidden in some kind of advanced tab depending on the Android version and the ROM you are using in the backup and reset tap on factory data reset and then tap on reset device again it will erase all the data on your phone and it will it won't hurt your um, SD card memory so that is safe now once you have restarted your phone check if you're getting SMS thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe